Well, you were right, Victor. Miranda's grandmother-in-law is missing. The circumstances are fishy. And I think I'm gonna call her about what I saw in her mother-in-law's trunk. Well, I'm glad, because Miranda should know something like that. You know, you shouldn't be hesitant to speak to her. You're both adults. I hope you can understand why I'm so hesitant to contact her. You know, I still want her. And I'm not a homewrecker. She's married. Every time we're together, something happens. I don't want to be the reason that her marriage falls apart. But every time I see her, every standard I have for myself falls by the wayside. I get it. But I always stand by the notion that you are both two consenting adults. And I'll leave it at that. I'm only doing this because if what I saw in her mother-in-law's trunk was indeed blood, then someone needs to know about that. Brian, after what happened last time between us, I can't talk to you. I, I can't forgive myself for what I did. We shouldn't have contact. I'm not that type of woman. I really don't think we should talk to each other. I understand, but it's important though, Miranda. The other day, I was at the shop. And I'm sorry, please don't make this harder than it is. I, I can't talk to you. I really can't. We can't have contact. I took my vows to Joey. No matter what we're going through at the time, I'm married to him. I'm not divorced. I can't talk to you, Brian. I really can't. It's not good, okay? So please. She hung up. Well, I get why she hung up. She's just like you. Maybe if you text her what you know, so she can read it and call you back. Victor, Miranda's right. We shouldn't have any contact. Before my girlfriend died, before I went through all my grief, before I lost myself, I would have never spoken to a married woman if I was interested in her. And I still want Miranda. So, it's over. I'm sure Miranda will figure out whatever she needs to figure out in terms of her missing grandmother-in-law. I need to do the right thing. I need to stay away from her. Why does it always seem like you're on a CW drama? Just talk to the woman.